All right, you guys, we are back with more Quantum Quattro from Peru. I did a poll on Instagram on what you guys want to see unbox next, and this was it. I just got this box yesterday. I was waiting on this Peruvian vendor to make more palms, hearts, spheres, and tumbles, and I bought <laughs> I bought the lot. So let's open these gorgeous pieces. These look like they're the palms. It looks like some really, really cool ones in here. Oh, and if you want to be involved in future polls, make sure to go follow us over on Instagram at coldbrewcrystals underscore official. I do daily updates over there and announce our launches and everything. So if you want more info, make sure to go follow us over there. But let's open these up. Ooh, ooh we got a lot. So we got one kilo of each, same amount as last time. Ooh, I'm already seeing some good ones. This is the very first one we pulled out. It's so pretty. This one has some dendritic. It's more of a darker moody one. Next we have this one. This one's more of like a, a worry stone, more of a flat stone. You can see these ones are like the other ones. Some pieces are half raw, half polished. Then we have this one. This one has a lot more quartz and a lot more of the chrysocolla and tourmaline. Oh, and if you didn't see my last video, so the Quantum Quattro is made up of several different minerals. It's made up of chrysocolla, malachite. Whoa! <laughs> this one is so cool. Quartz, which is the clear or the cloudy part. It also has tourmaline, dendritic, azurite, lots of fun minerals but this one is so cool wow i love how clear the quartz can get on some of these pieces oh this one is so cool it's got all kinds of texture and bugs on it really pretty 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 color this one has the azurite right there this one is so cool. It has so much personality. I love the clear quartz bits. This is the next one. Wow, this one has a rainbow. Ooh, the green is that malachite. So this one has a ton of malachite. All wow, the texture in here is so good. I love the palm stones. I think they're just so unique. This one has a ton of the mint. Oh, wow, that's so pretty. This is the next one. This one looks like it has some hematite right there in the tourmaline. A little bug right there. Ooh, this is a cool one. I love the ones with the big quartz windows. That is so fun. And these will all be listed individually, so you can choose which one you would like. Wow, this one has the hematite too, the little pops of red. The last ones we had didn't have as much hematite, which is really cool. Oh, wow. This one's like almost all quartz, I think. Yeah, that has little baby dendritics there. And this looks like it's just how the stone was. So they obviously didn't polish it down because it would have made the palm stone a lot smaller. So they just left it raw here. But this one's really cool. It has the rainbow and then it has a little pocket of chrysocolla here. It's a really unique one. It's almost all quartz. Ooh, <laughs> this one is huge. Wow, I love those formations. Some of these pieces can look very chaotic, but they're so special. This one looks like it got a bite taken out of it. It's kind of more of a pear shape, but lots of tourmaline on this one. Here's another one. Some malachite. Ooh, lots of tourmaline here. That's a cute one. Ooh, this one's got some sheen on it. So I actually haven't seen these. I just told him I wanted a kilo and he put it in a box and sent it to me. So this is my first time seeing them too. Ooh, this one's so pretty. I wonder what the yellow is. I think some of the other ones had yellow. There's some hematite going through. Ooh, that one is a cool piece and some dendritics. Ooh, I love this one. Lots of tourmaline, chrysocolla, malachite. This one's really cool. All right, and we got two left in here. We got this one with some dendritic and tourmaline, more of a milky quartz. And we have this one. Ooh, wow. That's beautiful. <laughs> so cool. I love how these came from the same spot in the mine, but they're so incredibly different. These have such amazing personality. All right, let's do some hearts next. I think these are the hearts. Yeah, I can see the shape. All right, let's open these babies up. All right, this is our first one right here. It's kind of a mint green and quartz. Oh, that's so pretty on the back. Ooh, 
This one is so stunning. Got a lot of the yellow and red and tourmaline. Beautiful. And she is a puffier heart. Oh, this one is so precious and tiny. This one's a little skinnier one. Beautiful. Ooh, this is a big one. This one has kind of similar vibes. This one, but it's so much smaller. I love this big section of clear quartz right here. Oh, these have a really nice polish on them. That's a pretty big heart. Next is this one. This one has another clear quartz top. Beautiful patterning right here. Oh, and it's got a, a big open vug right here. Oof, that one is so pretty. Next is this one. Ooh, that is so pretty. Oh, I love these. You can see right through the quartz on this one. Pretty big one as well. This looks like maybe one of the smaller ones. Really good color. I love that ombre from the blue to the yellow. Oh, this one looks cute. It's got like a little pattern right here. Ooh, that's pretty. The malachite right up in the top. All right, we got three more of these. This one has dendritics all the way around it. Like a little pop of hematite in there and some iron here. I think that's what the yellow is. Beautiful. These are two of the larger ones. Beautiful. Ooh, this one has a lot of tourmaline here. So pretty. Hopefully that fan wasn't too loud. Ooh, and this is the last one. This one's maybe my favorite. So pretty. I love that one. The color is so nice. Alright, we'll move these over here. And then we'll do spheres next. And then we have some tumbles. And the tumbles look pretty big too. Oh, these look like smaller spheres. The last time I got these, I had pretty big spheres. So I think we only had like five or six. But this looks like maybe there's ten in here. <laughs> it looks like a really big one. But they all look a really nice size. Oh my gosh. Alright, let's see what we got. This is the first one. So cute. I love these. I'm glad we have some mini spheres this time because last time I felt like we had only big sizes. Ooh, this one has a little bit of sparkle. Ooh, really, really pretty. Blue with dendritic. I was gonna say it doesn't match my nails. <laughs> Next we have another mini. This one has sparkle too. I love these pretty little mint green colors. Ooh, this one's really fun. This one kind of matches the heart with the yellow. Ooh. So pretty. Oh, I love that one. Next is this one. Got some tourmaline. So pretty. I like the size of these spheres. They're like a perfect size. We'll save the big one for last. Ooh, this one has a ton of really rich color. There's a bug right here. One's a little smaller than the other ones. Ooh, this one is so cool. It's got so much texture and personality. Wow, the color is just so vibrant on this one. Wow, this one's super, super cool. Next is this one. You can really see the azurite in here. Lots of tourmaline on this one. Really, really, really cool. Next we have this one. Oh my gosh, this one is so cool. I mean, they're all really cool. I know I keep saying that. Wow, you get a lot of credit for the malachite here. I love the layers of color. Big Vug. This one has really cool black veining on it. And then we got two left. We have this one. Ooh, this one has a lot of the clear quartz on it. And the hematite. I love this one. The color looks like it's floating. And then we have the big one. Whoa, oh my gosh. This is so cool. I was not expecting it to look like this. I didn't look at it when I pulled it out. Wow. This one has so much color on it. Oh, look at that. The blue and the green, the yellow, the red. Wow, that one is incredibly stunning. Oh, I love it. I love it. Okay, and now we'll do the tumbles. Bag was just open, so I almost dumped it. <laughs> but we won't look at all these individually. They'll be intuitively selected, but I just want to show you what they look like. Lots of different ones. This one is so cool. And last time we split them up into small and medium, so we'll probably do that again depending on... Ooh, that one is just literally clear quartz with the teeniest tiny bit of Graysicola. Really pretty though. We'll split them up in size. Like this one is a teeny tiny one compared. 
I mean, it's not that much smaller, but these are very similar to the ones we had. Because they are so different, just based on what I pick for you, if you have a request, I could try to accommodate it, but it's just based on what we have left. But they all look pretty similar. Ooh, there's some brown ones in here. And if there's any ones that don't look the greatest, we'll pull those out. But they all look pretty similar. I mean, I know they look different, but they'll be pretty affordable. So, you know, if you'd rather use these for grid work, or see if you like the material that's a great way to test it out to see if you want to invest in a larger piece it looks like we've got a lot of tumbles wow <laughs> that's so pretty that looks so fun all right you guys i think that is everything lots of really fun pieces they feel similar yet different than our last unboxing and if you want to watch the last unboxing i'll link it down below in case you want to see what that lot of quantum quattro looked like Make sure to go follow us on Instagram at coldbrewcrystals underscore official to get all of our latest shop updates. And if you like this kind of content, we do new crystal launches every Wednesday at 7.30 p.m. Central Standard Time. And we do crystal order packing videos on Sundays at 11.30 a.m. Central Standard Time. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you on the next one. Love you. Bye. Hey, question for you. Have you been thinking about starting a crystal business? Don't know where to start or feel a lack of community? Well, guess what you guys? I have a Patreon that has access to a private community and Discord server for just $18 a month. You can learn from other businesses, make friends, learn along with me and topics include pricing, shipping, Shopify, Etsy, and so much more. So head over and join us on Patreon for just $18 a month. Everything is linked in my bio.